In this video, you will learn how to make a simple terrarium out of a two liter soda bottle. This terrarium can be used to temporarily keep isopods you find outside in order to study them. For more information about this project, check out the link in the description. The materials you will need are a two liter soda bottle, a piece of cardstock paper, scissors, a utility knife, and a permanent marker. The media you will need include potting soil, three cups of gravel, and one cup of activated carbon, along with a spray bottle filled with water. The activated carbon is optional. You will also need two to three small plants, food scraps, and two to three brown tree leaves. You can find isopods such as pill bugs outside. Look in moist areas, beneath rocks in the garden, around decaying wood or leaves, or in a compost pile. These are prime isopod habitats. Step one. Tape the cardstock paper so that it is covering about five inches from the bottom of the bottle. Step two. Use the permanent marker to draw a line on the bottle using the top edge of the paper as a guide. Step 3. Use a utility knife to cut a small slit in the bottle on the line. Cut along the rest of the line using the scissors. Step four, cut three one and a half centimeter slits in the bottom of the bottle, approximately 11 centimeters apart from each other. Step five, add about one inch of gravel, then add a quarter inch of activated carbon, and last, add about three inches of potting soil. Step six, spacing them out evenly, bury the roots of your plants in the soil. Step seven, moisten the soil evenly using the spray bottle.
Step 8. Go outside and find some isopods to keep for a while. Step 9. Gently place the isopods in your terrarium along with a dead leaf or two for cover. Step 10. Place some food scraps in the terrarium for the isopods to eat. Step 11. Slide the top of the bottle over the bottom and place your terrarium somewhere out of direct sunlight. Observe your isopods daily to see what they're doing. When you are done with observations, release them back outside. Don't forget to check out the link for more information.